Hi guys. Um, what I'm going to do for you today is a Packer inspired eye makeup. And I'm wearing my Packer gear. This is a like an Aaron Rodgers t-shirt jersey. Okay. And um, we are in the playoffs which is huge, and uh, for those of you who may not know, the Packers are a football team, and the playoffs are what leads up to the Super Bowl, and we are playing against the Atlanta Falcons this weekend on Sunday at like 3.30, I think, I think, anyways, and so it's really, really exciting, um, Packer fans are some of the best fans in the world, we are so so into the Packers, like we have a problem, we're scary. Everybody that is a Packer fan, is a Packer fan for life, and crazy about it, crazy. We're like one of the few stadiums that sold out um, every single game because like we have all season tickets. My parents have like, you know, lifetime season tickets and everything, so we're big Packer fans. So. I'm going to put on my sweatshirt because it's really cold, but I wanted to show you my t-shirt. So, <clears throat> the thought crossed my mind for a second, like, oh, should I do an Atlanta Falcons makeup? Because, you know, it's the playoffs, like, you should, everyone should do it, and then I decided no. No, I will not do an Atlanta Falcons makeup, so sorry. That's just too bad for you. This is like really bright in my face. It's not bright in my face, but it looks much better. Okay, so I have my face makeup done because I went to work this morning. It's not perfect because I took like literally five minutes on it, but we're just concentrating on the eyes, so it doesn't matter. So the first thing I'm going to do is, and this is all super inexpensive. I don't think I'm going to use any like MAC or anything today. No. No, I won't. Um, let me scoot this. Things are falling off. Forward a little bit. Get off all the goop. And so this is my NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk. And these are like $4 or $5. And I got mine at Ulta. And I'm just gonna... Put this all over my lid. I'm sorry, I have a little bit of... Um like green or like emerald silver or something like that from um, Sephora because it was my birthday gift so I'm just gonna blend that in and get rid of the edges it doesn't have to be perfect at all this is just the base I already have some um... oh no I don't I was gonna say I have Urban Decay Shadow ah, eyeshadow primer potion and I don't today, but whatever. Um, this is just for show. But usually I would put the powder potion on and then the jumbo eyeshadow pencil and you don't want to go past your crease because then it'll crease. My makeup hasn't creased since I got the Urban Decay Primer Potion. That was probably like two or three years ago. Not even kidding. I was dating a totally different guy. <laughs> I remember because he was mad at me that I spent money on it, $17. But yeah, so. It's lasted me forever, and my boyfriend actually depotted it for me because he doesn't trust me with sharp things. And he, we put it in this baby food jar, and it's just like all along the rim. And like, look how much is still in there after two years. Well worth the money, I'd say. I won't have to buy another one for like another two or three years, so it's crazy. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my 88 palette that I got for Christmas from my mommy and daddy, I guess. And I'm going to just take this bright yellow right here. Suck it down. Right here. And I'm just going to get it on my large, it's like a flat eyeshadow brush. I'm just going to pack it on there. And tap off just once because I really want it on there. And I'm just going to pack it on. Excuse me for looking at my mirror. 
I haven't used the yellow yet and I was really excited about it. Because I just like yellow. I think whenever I see yellow I think of um, my friend Shannon when I was a kid. Her favorite color was yellow and she was just the brightest, most fun girl. And so it's not only just a bright color in itself, but that was her favorite, favorite color. and She was so much fun. So that's what I think of. It just makes me happy when I see yellow. Shannon. And so then I'm packing it all on the lid and then kind of dispersing it as it goes up higher. You want it more in the center and towards the bottom is the yellow. So the Green Bay Packers, uh, Green Bay is in the northern, more northern part of Wisconsin. If you ever look at Wisconsin, it looks like a mitten. I'm sorry, my, my, this thumb is really messed up. It looks like a mitten and like I'm down here in Milwaukee. And then Green Bay is this bay right here. Where, um, Lake Michigan? Is it Lake Michigan? <laughs> I don't know. That's really bad that I don't know that. I don't know if Lake Michigan, like, continues up and goes in here. I think it does. Whatever. Um, <laughs> it's a bay. So Green Bay is up there. And it's maybe, like, two, two and a half hours away. And I'm just going over this again just to make sure. And it doesn't look as good because I've already done my makeup today, so it's obviously going to look better in a lot on a clean face. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this um, synthetic, like, angled eyeliner brush that I use for my eyebrows usually. But I'm just going to take this green. Any one of these greens really works. If you want more natural, you can go for more of a blue-green or... A darker green like so it's less bright but I'm going like kind of in between tab it off a little bit and I'm gonna put it right under my uh, bottom lash line just tap it in there see and I'm gonna go like three-fourths of the way in I'm not gonna bring it all the way up into the um, tear duct area just along most of the lashes. Just patting that in there. Excuse my sniffles, I'm still having a cold. That didn't, it didn't make sense, but okay. Still having a cold. I still have a cold. Alright, when I'm done with that, I'm gonna take, oh, I look really sad and stuff like that. Um, I'm gonna take it and bring it up like that and that's going to be like the guideline for the upper green area a little bit more here and then just for funsies I'm going to take a really small this could be a crease, crease butt brush I usually use it as like a blending and I'm just going to take it to blend out the bottom. <laughs> I don't mind making weird noises today. I'm in a very weird mood. I went to Sally's and they gave me a free argan oil face mask and a free argan oil lotion. I'm not sure if she was supposed to. I don't know. It just like ended up in my bag. She didn't even say anything about it. So maybe I stole it. I don't know. Um... But it wasn't on the receipt or anything. I don't know. So, I'm going to take that same green and I'm putting it on a crease brush. And I'm going to, like, you know, like, open your eyes. Like, stretch this really wide, but close your actual eyelid. So you can see exactly where you want to put this. And don't go farther down than this line here. But just bring it on... Um, and fill in this crease area up to where the line ends. I've done very many, very many, a lot of um, variations on Green Bay Packer makeup because we have a game of the week. And so for my family's Christmas party was on the 26th. 